parallelamente non c'è mai resistita. So, with this technology, we are not giving you And how it became 
so violent. It's the environment which has caused us to be so violent, so aggressive. This is the tribe which the scientists tell us, all of us, in this room, and around, and around the world, where our ancestors came from. These guys are remnants of the original tribe of man. After millions of years, they still carry the same. Tool of killing, tool of war. Hunt for animals and then, and then hunt for a man. The only difference from this point, where thousands of years ago all our ancestors started, and today, is very, very simple. We still carry on the same kind of thoughts and aggression. We still look for a place to call home and be safe in. All we've done, we have developed a better tool of killing. In reality, our intention and thoughts from millions of years ago has never changed. The difference between him and us, we are better dressed. Better way to disguise our intentions. In fact, if you look at this picture, we are still living in the same process. But we call this a scavenging work. We call this a scavenging stealing and thieving. And we call this behavior we call it in the name of different religions and beliefs. We haven't stopped aggression. We haven't stopped. We have not. We just developed a better tool. More effective way to kill each other. The ones who have more money, just they begin making bigger guns to kill more. It's very simple. We know what is done. It's a Hiroshima bomb. These are the consequences of These are intercontinental missiles. Same aircraft with better weapons to kill the other one. And we are very proud in how precise we are to kill each other. We conflict, we inflict pain on the others, and we made the most advanced systems to do it. We spend billions in justifying how we kill, in respect of nationality. He says, Earth, what government think I am like? What I'm really like? That's all it is. We have 
we have put different colors on it to justify parking. Earth without man is a beautiful and peaceful place. In the universe, is the man who's made it such a horrible place for each other to live. What we say, change is needed. I'm going to make this because people can see. The change is all peace. Not by talk, but by action. The action is change is possible in believing what you do is correct and you're doing it in a correct way. As part of the Cash Foundation development, we say through new understanding of the structure of the plasma and their interactions in the creation of matter and motion, most of man's hunger for energy, food, water and wealth can be satisfied. Attraverso una nuova comprensione della struttura del plasma, dei plasma e della loro interazione nella creazione delle materie e del movimento, la maggior parte della desiderio dell'uomo di energia, cibo, acqua e benessere potrà essere soddisfatto.
what else do you want to fight for? So we've taken the cause of war away from you. Now, now is your turn to make the effort to develop this technology to serve other human beings. E questo è adesso il vostro momento di sviluppare questa tecnologia per servire, per essere utili ad altri esseri umani. The knowledge now, it says, transport technology not, not just for a few, but for all. Ma non solo per pochi, ma per tutti. For the poor, per i poveri. This is the refugee camp in Pakistan, in Afghanistan. These people have decency, they had a life to live for centuries, now they become poor because of another man's action, greed. On the name of religion, on the name of politics, and on the name of arms. Who gave experience? Excuse to the other one to start it, nobody will ever know. These are the poor people who will benefit by this technology more than anybody else. Because the rich and the kings already have most of the things they want. Some of you have seen. In the center, that's me writing the fourth book last year. In the center. Last summer, when I was finishing the book number four. This lady, Her Majesty the Queen of Belgium, came and said, "Come and speak to Mr. Kachin." She, it, this is in a remote place, nobody is there. She asked, can we, can we talk with you, Mr. Keshe? And as you see, we, we sat down talking for an hour on a coffee. And the gentleman in the background is the King of Belgium. In the palaces of King of Belgium is the, is the same three books as is outside for you. The knowledge has been given to the king, to the poor, to the masses, and to a few. Depends what they do with it. What they do with it. This is the Cash Foundation Center in the Old Cash Foundation. All colors and races. And this is the masses. The knowledge, the knowledge is outside for you. Which one of you does what with it to create a condition for peace? It will not be easy. It goes to a new understanding of the world of creation. The whole problem is none of us ever understood the whole concept. The whole concept of the world of creation. We try to explain to you how simple it is. If you've been to my lectures, you understand it. Well, this is what we call plasma. This could be an electron, a proton, a solar system, a universe. There is no difference in the structure. If we are spending so much money to harvest the energy of a fusion of an atom, we cannot understand.
understand the same technology, the same knowledge, because the structure is the same. La struttura è la stessa, possiamo utilizzare la stessa tecnologia. Allows us the same energy to be used for peaceful purposes. E utilizzare la stessa tecnologia per scopi pacifici. The new plasma technology can create a new era for humanity. La nuova tecnologia del plasma può creare una nuova era. With peace, with prosperity, pace, prosperità, mutual respect, rispetto reciproco and brother. e fratellanza. Till we don't learn this, we cannot break through the barriers of Earth. Non possiamo abbattere le barriere che ci sono sulla Terra. Because we are spending too much energy fighting each other, that creating a condition that we can travel beyond this planet and have a peaceful life. Piuttosto che noi invece creare delle condizioni per viaggiare al di là di questo pianeta, oltre questo pianeta. The new plasma technology can break. La nuova tecnologia al plasma può rompere. Effective solution for energy, food, water, health. Transport of new materials. Anywhere in the universe. Because once we learn to use it, we can apply it anywhere. The biggest problem for us as humans is the fear of new. We are all the we, we are afraid of a new neighbor. We are afraid of a new car. We are afraid of new love. It's not that we are afraid of them. We are not certain of our own action and behavior towards them. Non è proprio che non ci abbiamo paura di loro, ma probabilmente non abbiamo fiducia nelle nostre azioni, quello che dovremmo fare nel loro confronto. E se non capiamo noi stessi, non capiamo le nostre debolezze, non capiamo le nostre debolezze, non capiamo le nostre debolezze. This become tools of war. Fundamental changes with the new science has brought and will bring to the present world structure. The changes are fundamental. This is finished. Due to the magnetic gravitational field of the new plasma technology, this makes modern weapon technology obsolete. Due to the magnetic gravitational field of the new plasma technology, this makes the present modern weapon technology obsolete. What does this mean? We see this. Do you know, if you want to know how easy the rest is, we know exactly what this is and why it's here. This is the most advanced aircraft ever developed by our and we know how easily it was captured over here in the So, the rest are irrelevant. This is what they call intercontinental missiles or nuclear rockets. In the past few weeks there is a discussion that one of the countries under this flag on another one. What I did, I immediately contacted the countries and I informed them Instead of starting a war that this might be used, we give you a system that they can disable it, that it can never be used, for there is no reason for war. So, with providing and creating
creating a new industry, a new technology. You keep respect for every nation. You keep respect for every religion. You respect for humanity and science. As I always say, Keshe Foundation and the people who follow us, we are color blind, we are religious blind, we are nation blind. Even though some are pushing to say that we support the Iranian government, we are I'm Iranian, I'm proud to be Iranian. As much as you're Italian, you're proud to be Italian. We are proud of what our nations achieve, and we are proud of Depends if it suits us. 
which up to now building a railway track in Africa is a huge problem. You have forests, you have deserts, you have all sorts of problems. World Bank has allocated here about 10 billion to build a seven country Central South Africa railway track. Now you don't need to have a track to go from one point to the other. You, you come down, you go up, you come down. You don't damage any forest, you don't damage any environment. You don't get, you don't get disturbed by the uh, weather. So, and, the, and the materials in Africa for the African to help themselves, the whole thing can be done in less than 2 to 5 million euros from 10 billion. By, by putting, by, by putting already backdrop nations on the more burden of debt. This way you create new jobs for nationals, you create a new condition, you encourage the growth of the nations. This is the beauty the people in, in South Africa who listen to this program, they know what I'm talking about and what they're talking about. The biggest change, the biggest change this technology will bring, will open a space to us the way aircrafts open the earth to us. I met a guy five years ago in Tehran whose uncle came from Russia around the uh, early 19th century, early 20th century, and he said the Russians have something metal which goes in the air and he flies. And everybody said, you're crazy, this is rubbish, you know, you're mental. And now, and now we wear suits, we wear ties, and we are happy to travel first class in the same metal box. We call it aircraft. I want you to look at this. This is very important. A lot of you ask, ask us why you give things to government. This is a picture of what is in the hand of your government of the space system. You can see program, the scale 1 to 200, the spaceship program, the spaceship concept, and the design. You wanted to see what your governments have received? This is one of the this beautiful machine does everything we can imagine. It's a planet on its own. Creates food, creates air, creates water, creates electricity, provides for your health. Provides for your motion and creates a protection. We call it atmosphere. Some people would like it to call it magnetic shield. But that's simple transfer of gravitational position. This system would allow us to save powers from any activities that we become instinct like dinosaurs because of one of these things coming to us. 
We don't need to sit and by chance see which part of one of the satellites which was launched years ago will hit which one of us where. The technology allows us to capture debris anywhere in the universe. Transportation is very easy. This shining dome is not a structure, it's actually a magnetic field. The same system, when it lands, it creates its own shielding, so you lay the air over the cone. Allows us deep space and interstellar travel. And the beauty of it is, if you've been on the Cash Foundation website, the technology is in the hand of all these nations which means over 70% of the world population governments have already received the technology. There are a couple of these governments in this picture who have actually bought into the steps of manufacturing and development. The Cash Foundation mission Share knowledge and prosperity, stop conflicts, and respect for life anywhere in the universe because we are not alone. More and more scientists are confirmed that we are not alone. We just we are too proud and too arrogant to think we are the only one. The causes of conflict up to now has been what we said at the beginning. What governments think I'm like. What religions think I'm like. And then the scientists have their own say and their own problem. They think that what the earth is and what the earth is like. The peace will come only in one case and no other way. When the consensus among all three politicians, religious leaders, scientists, are needed, are needed in an equal measure if the human race is to survive as a race on earth and in space. Because we take this behavior outside, they divide us and they finish us. We have to put the house in order here before we go beyond the boundaries. And this is the World Peace Treaty Plan for Cash Foundation. What we say, Earth Peace Treaty through the education of the new technology. We are the only organization which is not talking about world peace as an organization. But talking about both is because we have the tools to enforce it. Uh, and if you've been on the Cash Foundation website in the past week, you know that we are negotiating with six countries, six nations, industrialists, and governments for the full commercialization of the technology. We are not doing it. You people who understand what this can do for your nations are doing it. The example of it is We are not the only people who are making the new reactors. 
You have a German here from Malta. Siamo in giro con Fabio che stiamo producendo nuovi attori. Che abbiamo una persona da Malta. He has flown from Malta. Ha lavorato da Malta. With a reactor which they have manufactured in Malta. He has Il never spoken about it. They have never spoken that they are developing this. We knew, we kept our silence. And now they are testing the reactors. Do you mind bringing it? Let's yeah. bring it, Tara. They are proud to be Maltese and they've done what they've done. But this is where the change is coming. This is where people, scientists, and he's put He's put his life at risk to bring the system here. Because he could be arrested. He says, I don't want it, I'm leaving it behind. He says, I'm leaving it behind because I don't want more problems on my back to Malta. So now, this is the first reactor built by Maltese, which has been brought here today to be here. There is a team of scientists on there. He is not alone, he is a team of them. Uh, Ronte. Yes, Ronte. So, you see, this is very strange thing. Can you, can you bring the camera to show this please? Because people around the world want to see it. And the, and the interesting thing, and the interesting, and the interesting point is that, that this gentleman and his colleagues are negotiating with the government for the Cash Foundation to develop the technology in Malta. Can you take it? What we do to the same So, you see, we even didn't know to put a thousand that our ship is here. <laughs> you can see, go to the front as much as you can. Can you shift and go right down and get it? Or can you bring the system to it? But they want to see. If you remember, on the 16th of December, we showed the Italian design. And you as Italians were proud that one of you managed to do a drawing of this technology. Now you see the technology is not in our hands anymore. It is in the hand of people and they are developing it in their own way. And as somebody who has worked on this technology for years, this is absolutely beautiful the way they've done it. And I can tell you, it takes me two days to get this system flying. And it will take us less than a day to make it to produce energy. But they have to do it. Not us anymore. Is you can't come say cash for nature, give us the technology. No. Scientists around the world are developing it. There is a there are two nations now producing systems, they have produced system which is produced energy. There are as many systems of possibilities to create energy and motion. And there are stars in the sky. So you have to find your way, your system. This is why we do not show, we do not do anything, but we keep away from it. A lot of people put a lot of pressure on the Cash Foundation to show things. 
mostrare le cose, perché gli mostrassimo le cose. If you go on the foundation in the past four or five days, we announced that we received the first non-nuclear reactor from our manufacturer, ready for testing. And some people are wrong to us. This is another excuse for delaying to deliver 150 power generators to some people. These reactors have to be changed that is acceptable by governments, acceptable by nations, and safe. This is respect for the scientists and for their job. So, the whole thing comes, now we know, you've seen on the website, the Canadians are doing it, the Bulgarians are at it, because we have two workshops with them. Now, you see, you know your Italian scientists are busy with it, very happy, we know, we know the Americans are at it, we know Indonesia, we know the Iranians have it for a few years, and for those who said to us we are looking for an excuse, when we said we just received the reactor from the manufacturer, this is the first time in public we show this, this is the nuclear reactor, non-nuclear reactor, which has just been received, which has just been received. This, the system in this box will change your lives. You can see this is the leg of the reactor. And I'll give you one pleasure. Who would like to open it? We all look at it in the same. I think uh, uh, we give a chance to the Maltese because they don't <laughs> Earth doesn't 
doesn't have different departments for energy, motion, and food. Trees grow, we are in motion in the universe, we get herbs to live and we wake up. So this is the first time we show this in public. And this, uh, this system in different miniature sizes or larger size will change every one of your lives. To build this has cost hundreds of thousands of euros. Test, trial, error, failure, rebuilding, retesting. What is not so simple as you see internally is a giant. This system on its own can carry anything up to 50 to 100,000 tons. So, those who wanted to see this reactor, which is going to create energy for you very soon, now it's in our hands, we received it. It took over six months to adjust it to do what it's supposed to do. Do you want to tell me? Yes. Yeah. Uh, you see, it has, believe you me, a lot of engineers will start copying in this tomorrow, but they don't know what's inside it. <laughs> the shape is not important, what's inside is important. The is not important, Let me explain to you something very simple. In this room, there are people who are part of the test project in developing reactors for different areas. So, amongst you are people who are working with us to bring this into your area. It's for them to declare who they are, not for us to say what they are.
in the hand of your government. We leave you me tonight. A few ministers and presidents will have a restless night. Because they never thought could show this in public. You will see this out next time when he flies. And most probably you fly out of Italy. The first time you will fly this system will be out of Italy because you are Italian based. So, so, you have to... Father? Yes. So, can we sit down please? Now, you wanted to see, you wanted to see a space reactor, you have seen it. Now, they turn it back the other way. Thank you. 
کتاب فراست کی؟ Come and pick it up, find yours, and go and live by it. Because you have witnessed to your own change, not for us to keep. Very soon, we will show you what we call flying saucer. Very soon you will see the generators because understand one problem. This picture had a fundamental cause and has been one of the reasons we are here. After this meeting with the King of Belgium, after a lot of discussion, and the Queen of Belgium, in a, in a cafe, over a cup of tea or coffee, I realized my ambition and my wish for world peace will never ever come to reality if I stay in Belgium. The king of a nation explained to me what the thoughts are behind me. And we moved to Italy and all the doors have opened up. And I thank you. For having time to make the change in your lives, not for us, but for yourselves. I had a beautiful email very recently. The email reads in a way, our nation is signed to peace. Our presidents have no objection to signing for peace treaty because we will never develop tools of war. The presidents, the world leaders, understand there is one way out of this mess we are in today. Not by causing more wars, because their own children, their own wives themselves get killed through these wars. And they know in time doesn't matter what they wear, what crown they put on their head, what they carry on the back on the front of their room for a temporary time they're in that room as a president or prime minister. Soon they will be sick that there is no solution in the present world of medicine. And they need the technology to save their lives or their children. Believe you me, we have a number of presidents and their family and royal people as the Cash Foundation Health Program. Abbiamo molti, ci sono moltissimi governanti che hanno capito che per il benessere dei loro figli e dei loro popoli devono adottare queste nuove tecnologie. Abbiamo molti governanti che si sono affidati alla Cash Foundation. We need World Peace Treaty to be signed and to be lived by from now on that we can open the door into the space for all of us. Because outside this human shell of earth is a beautiful community which is waiting for you to join in. If you want to understand how we've been treated as human beings, we are like dogs in the quarantine. We've been kept in till we get rid of the disease which is fighting and war. Then they let us out. It's not that they don't want to be with us. It's us who have put ourselves in the cage of war. A lot of you speak about yourselves. You become part of the UFO system because now you know how the system works. You know how it is. 
where the magnetic gravitational field of the system interacts with Earth, what would you get? Light. Like the way the Earth magnetic gravitational field interacts with the Sun, we get daylight. A new version of this in a smaller size is your future light bulb. Systems which absorb energy from the environment and the interaction allows you to have light. This technology from now on, which is now we opened it for the first time, we showed in public. Will touch your life, your grandmother, grandchild life, your great grandchild life, the fish in the sea, the cat on the wall. Because once you create a good environment, the fish doesn't get hurt. Nothing to kill the bees. So the benefit for this new technology is not just for mankind, it's for Quindi all the inhabitants of the So I thank you for coming. And I hope you take from this meeting and the people who are around the world in 90 odd places around and throughout the world who will be watching this program that they understand the change has to come through us, within us, and through our governments, not by fighting them. Pray. Pray for your leaders that they understand the beauty of the technology and in turn they will respond back to you. Your religious leaders, your government leaders, your local authority leaders, your husband, your child, you all need to pray for that we can all live a peaceful life. And this is what the world of history is. Peace, not on earth, but inside the heart that we can live in correctly.
And in this case, it's very true. Thank you very much.